Uh, this next tune, I think, uh, I think uh, Mick has a, a better a story to tell. It. Would you yeah. mind telling a story about well, this? Well, I talked about it a bit earlier when we were talking, and um, this song has has had a, an effect on me um, from the moment we that I first started writing it. Uh, it was very emotional, and um, you know, from there to the recording of the song. Uh, we had recorded most of the song and it came down to putting the vocal on and, and Lou. Um, the singer at the time, Lou, uh, had, uh, was ready to sing and suddenly a, a, a very beautiful girl walked into the studio and nobody really knew who it was. And um, red hair? Ginger? <laughs> I think so, yeah. yeah well, and, uh, maybe, maybe he's right. No, there's another one back there, yeah. Well, maybe so you can be, be the girl. <laughs> Um, and uh, she just stood there while Lou was singing and um, I think he was entranced by her and, and really uh, he, he, he sang an incredible um, performance of it and uh, that's what stayed on the record and uh, right at the end of the song um, she disappeared and, and nobody knew who she was and where she come from but Lou had sung the song to her and uh, whether she knows or not, to this day, I don't know. But um, so, if you're listening or watching, wherever you are, <laughs> we've been waiting quite a long time. <laughs> That's what we're here.
That's how you do it, baby. <laughs>